Amexines are a class of two-dimensional nanomaterials, named after their constituent elements. Transition metals, M, carbides, nitrides or oxides, X, and surface functional groups, such as hydroxyl, fluorine, etc. To date, over 70 Amexines have been reported, and more are still to be discovered. The research history of Amexines can be traced back to 2011. When Professor Yuri Gogotsi from Drexel University and his collaborator Professor Michel W. Barsome first reported a method to prepare T3C2TX emexine material using hydrofluoric acid as the exfoliating agent and electrochemical exfoliation. Subsequently, more and more scholars began to explore the preparation methods and properties of emexines. In 2014, researchers reported a method to exfoliate the original material using chlorine dioxide to prepare NB2C emexine. In the same year, Gogot C. et al. reported a new magnesium sulfate exfoliation method, which enabled the efficient preparation of various emexines. Thereafter, many studies on the preparation of emexines using acid treatment, alkali treatment, anhydrous hydrofluoric acid exfoliation, and electrochemical exfoliation methods have been reported. Emexines are a class of two-dimensional materials derived from the exfoliation of transition metal carbides, MX with a rich variety of types and synthesis methods. The following are some common emexine types and their corresponding synthesis methods. T3C2TX. This is the earliest reported emexine type, where T represents the transition metal titanium, C represents carbon, and TX represents the surface functional groups, usually fluorine or oxygen. T3C2TX emexines are typically prepared using hydrofluoric acid or electrochemical exfoliation. NB2CTX. This emexine is composed of the transition metal niobium and carbon. NB2CTX can be prepared using the chlorine dioxide exfoliation method. V2CTX. This emexine is composed of the transition metal vanadium and carbon. The preparation methods for V2CTX include acid treatment and electrochemical exfoliation. MO2CTX. This emexine is composed of the transition metal molybdenum and carbon. The preparation methods for MO2CTX include acid treatment and electrochemical exfoliation. In addition to the above common emexine types, there are many other emexine materials composed of various transition metals and carbon, such as CR2CTX, TOF4CTX, W2CTX, etc. Different emexine types can be achieved by adjusting the precursor materials, exfoliation methods, and subsequent processing steps. It should be noted that the preparation methods for emexines are not limited to the few mentioned above. Researchers are continuously exploring new synthesis strategies and material combinations to expand the diversity and application potential of the emexine family. Common emexine characterization techniques include X-ray diffraction, transmission electron microscopy, scanning electron microscopy, Raman spectroscopy, and X-ray photoelectron spectroscopy. These techniques can be used to determine the interlayer spacing, crystal structure, morphology, chemical composition, types and distribution of functional groups of emexines. The unique layered structure and chemical composition of emexines endow them with various excellent properties, such as electrical conductivity. Emexines have high electrical conductivity, making them important application materials in the fields of electrodes, sensors, and energy storage. Mechanical properties. Emexines have excellent mechanical strength and toughness, making them suitable for the fabrication of flexible electronic devices. Optical properties. The absorption and scattering characteristics of light by emexines are also widely studied, making them potential candidates for transparent conductive films, photocatalysts, and other applications. Chemical reactivity. The surface functional groups of emexines can react with various molecules, giving them tunable surface properties and chemical reactivity. Different types of emexines may have different properties and application potentials. And the properties of emexine materials are also often influenced by the precursor materials, exfoliation methods, and subsequent processing, requiring detailed characterization and research. As a frontier two-dimensional material, emexines have broad application prospects and research value in their future development. The following are some aspects of the future development of emexines. New synthesis methods. Currently, the main preparation methods for emexines are chemical exfoliation and electrochemical exfoliation. In the future, further research and development of new synthesis methods can be conducted to improve efficiency, reduce costs, and expand the variety of emexine materials. Structural control and performance optimization. 
By controlling the structure of MXenes, such as adjusting the interlayer spacing and modifying the functional groups, their performance can be optimized. Additionally, by combining MXenes with other nanomaterials or adding functional elements, the functionality and application fields of MXenes can be further expanded. Application Expansion MXenes have shown promising performance and application potential in the fields of electronic devices, energy storage materials, sensors, water treatment, and photocatalysis. In the future, further research and development of MXene applications in these fields can be conducted, and new application areas can also be explored. Nanocomposite materials. By compositing MXenes with other materials, synergistic nanocomposite materials can be obtained. These composite materials can further expand the properties and functions of MXenes, enhancing their applications in electronics, energy, and the environment. Systematic research. Future MXene research needs to be more systematic and comprehensive, including in-depth study of the relationships between the preparation, structure, properties, and applications of MXenes, to reveal their fundamental principles and mechanisms.